Having the right tools in place for your social media business is honestly half the work. For years, I was a Canva user until I discovered how much more I can do with Adobe Express. In this video, I'm sharing why I moved away from using Canva to now using Adobe Express for all of our social media content creation. Hey, my name is Mill and I own a multi six figure social media agency and I now help social media managers do the same. If you're new here, make sure to grab my free roadmap to becoming a six figure social media manager that I will drop right below. Now let's dive in. Now the first reason why I decided to move away from Canva into using Adobe Express is their generative AI tools. Now Adobe Firefly is a tool that has all the generative AI tools that are integrated within Adobe Express. Now, one of my favorites is being able to create social media assets for clients using their Adobe Firefly tools. And you will never run out of content for clients that I can now use into their social media graphics, carousels, any of their marketing material. And that is just only one of their AI features. Now, I've talked about AI features and tools a lot in my previous video where I mentioned to you that a lot of these AI tools can be a waste of time because there are so many out there on the market. You don't know which ones are good, which ones aren't, and you spend more time checking whether the work is actually accurate versus it helping with your time efficiency, right? And productivity. Now their generative AI tools in Adobe Express have blown my mind because we can take actual assets from our clients and create more assets like it, right? So this is very important for us to stay on brand, get assets from clients that they're not always able to provide. And it's just like an unlimited stock library that we create completely from scratch into whatever you want. Whatever you can imagine, you can create it with their AI tools. Now, if you're like, these are not really my style, I need it to be more in, in style with my clients. You can actually drag and drop an image from your client to upload and then say, create an interior design bathroom generate. So now you have bathrooms based on the style that you initially put in. Here are some more examples. Now, if you're like, mm, this one I like, you can actually edit it and take it at text and more, and it will take you into Adobe Express so that you can create the actual content for them. So now the image pops up here and you can add text, right? You can use that and you can actually change the fonts and do whatever you want with it. Make it white and you will never possibly run out of content for your clients. So here's an example where you can see where we did this for a client and how you can implement these into Adobe Express to start creating content with. If you're not familiar with Adobe Express or haven't tried them yet, then make sure you check them out because they have a completely free plan for you to check out risk-free. And I will drop the link below to give you easy access. The second reason why I decided to move away from Canva into Adobe Express is the Adobe Creative Cloud. Now, Adobe is very well known, right, for their programs and softwares that include Illustrator, Illustrator for graphic designers, Photoshop, and many more programs that Adobe just dominates in, right? Now, the great part about having an Adobe Creative Cloud membership is that it already includes Adobe Express. So you don't have to pay extra once you already have access to all of these tools. And I think that is one of the best things about it because Adobe Express makes it so easy to create content, but you still have other professional programs in case your graphic designer needs it or a photographer or videographer on your team needs the other programs Adobe Creative Cloud offers. So you get the best of both worlds because it's all included within your plan. And now because everything is included within one plan, there is a very easy integration with assets that you might create in Photoshop, Illustrator. So in the past, uh, we would always have this argument with our graphic designers to where they would be kind of against creating inside of Canva, right? They want to create inside of Adobe, right? because that is the professional programs. And this gives you best of both worlds because yes, they can create inside of Illustrator and move it into Adobe Express so that the entire team can use it and it's very accessible and easy. So again, it's 
pretty cool to see how the Adobe brings all these programs together. And of course, this is something you don't see with Canva at all. Now, remember that you don't need to get their paid plan just yet. You can start off with a free plan, check it out and see it for yourself before you upgrade. The third reason I decided to move away from Canva into Adobe Express is their high quality templates. Now, without a doubt, Canva has thousands of templates, right? It's almost overwhelming to go through their templates. And what I find with Adobe Express, they really have higher quality templates. And I say this because I pretty much have seen every single Canva template on social media at this point, right? It has become a commonly known theme around business owners where you can recognize a Canva template from miles away, right? So one thing I love about Adobe Express's template library is they organize it by type, by mood, by style. So it's very easy to find templates that actually fit for you rather than being lost in a bunch of templates like with Canva that is extremely overwhelming in my opinion. And I don't think it's so much about quantity of templates, but more about the quality, right? Because you don't need a thousand templates. You just need a few really good ones for inspiration that you can tweak, etc. And so this is one of the reasons why I like this a lot more in the Adobe Express template library versus how Canva does it. You can see an example here on what that looks like, but check it out for yourself using their free Adobe Express plan. Now, the fourth reason why I decided to move away from Canva into Adobe Express is their free resources. Now, one thing I absolutely love about Adobe Express is that inside of their program, they actually offer a link to the free resources that just has a bunch of one to two minute snippets that explains the features. Now, this is super useful for reference, not only for myself, but if you're completely new to Adobe Express and you're not quite familiar with the features yet, you can just simply go into this library, check out a one to two minute video that explains exactly how to do these things so that you can apply it. Now, me as an agency owner, it's also great for my team members when I put them onto Adobe Express and I don't have to explain everything, right? They have a full free resources library there so that they can learn, you can get better at designing and especially because social media managers already take so much on their plate, right? So again, this is very much a thumbs up for Adobe Express here to offer little, very short, to the point tutorials, because again, who has time to watch a 20 minute tutorial nowadays, right? So that wraps up my video on Canva versus Adobe Express and why I personally moved away from Canva to now using Adobe Express. If you haven't tried them yet, I highly encourage you to just check it out on their free plan. I wanna know from you too, do you use Adobe Express? Are you a Canva user? And yeah, let me know in the comments so that I can hear from you. If you haven't subscribed yet, make sure you do so because I post weekly videos and I will see you in next week's video.